What's up, YouTube? What's going on, guys? What's up, guys? What's going on, guys? Welcome to the Yakin and Pack. The Yakin and Pack. The Yakin and Pack. The Yakin and Pack. The Yakin and Pack channel. What's going on, guys? Welcome to the Yakin and Pack channel. Good? No, he's dead. Nick and I don't live in the same city anymore, so we have to plan our adventures in advance. We were lucky enough to link up on a Monday night. On our way to the river, we saw a heron. We tried to get him to fly for the camera, but no luck. This is quite the popular river, but due to the less than favorable weather, we had it all to ourselves. We cruised a fair way down the river and there were no other boats in sight. Of course, the only other boat on the river was trolling right in our spot. Almost like they knew we were coming and set up a perimeter. Now, unwritten rules state that it would be rude for us to force ourselves into the spot as they were there first. We drifted around a few hundred meters down from the bridge, hoping they would leave. I threw around a few different large cranks, hoping to hook it to some pike, and Nick was drop shotting, hoping to snag a walleye. The spot we were at wasn't producing, and we knew under the bridge would. Sneak in. Yeah. Well, I don't think it's fair that they're hogging the whole bridge. We're not even going for the same species. Should we have snuck in and fished under the bridge with them? Probably not. But they were circling around the pillars, so we figured we could just take the middle. One. They ended up being quite nice about it. Had the old, how's it going? You catching any? Conversation with them. How you doing? Did you see that? Well, I've never done that before. I literally set the hook on nothing. But you know what? You miss 100% of the hook sets you don't make. Like net? Yeah. 
pull them up a little higher. There. Even though that was the fish of the evening, we kept on bringing them in. Come on. Back you go. So remember those guys who were trolling earlier and didn't mind sharing the bridge? Well this happened. Can you boost them? Do you have cables or anything? No cables, but luckily they had the exact same battery as Nick. So they were able to use his battery to start up their boat with ease. Take care. Yeah, thank you very much. Highly appreciate it. Solid proof as to why you should always be nice to others on the river. You never know when you're going to need a hand. Well, good for them. They get, I said good for them. They at least get to go home. After they left, we got back at her. Oh, a little tappy tap. That is a dark rocket box. Oh, what? Rock bass, too? Slaying the rock bass. That's a, that's a big one too. So unwritten rules or not, be respectful of others out there. You never know when you're going to need them. And as always, see you next time on the Yagan and Packin' channel. Yeah! His buddy was very grateful. <laughs> when he was like, bro, start the boat, he just looked like, I don't know how to f to do that. <laughs> like, bro, he turned the key. <laughs> I always want to reach over and do it.